Hello people, yang Jeda here. Today I'm gonna teach you how to make a video on YouTube using Camtasia Studio 9. This is my channel Gamers Dude. I use Camtasia Studio 9, which I have bought and purchased a few months ago. And in the Camtasia Studio 9, there is three button new project new recording and open project new project is for the new uh, video that you want to make using import videos in the new recording basically you record the screen like what I'm doing right now so let's get to it see this is the new project you can import uh, sounds media which is videos and also recording in the file there is new project open project and also you can save in and you recording also there and you can connect to mobile device and you can even upload media to FTP for the website in the edit menu basically it is all your tool to make and edit and arrange data file and you can modify to add animation and you can view and also you can directly share to a local file which you can choose using the media or not using the player media player and also you can directly share it to YouTube there are two step one is the rendering and also uploading to YouTube now let's check it try it now I'm gonna import media which is a video called cause chaos chronicle now you can edit the timeline into the timeline there it goes so this is the video and you can also edit the video to the library and it will show up in the library and you will not have to look for the file later if you want to find it but if you change a lot in the folder and you cannot find it it will always be there in the library and you can rename that uh, file now you can also uh, check for more or you can import another media it is uh, unlimited how many media you want to import and also you can add another media into the timeline if you want to combine two videos or uh, combining a video and a picture you can input it in one track let's say track one so you see here this is video and then it will change to a picture And then for the annotation, it's basically uh, for description of some point in the video. I usually do that, or making an animation, uh, text animation, things like that, to make clearer of the what I'm doing in the video. And there is a lot of uh, media annotation there. And this is for the transition if you want to make it blur your video it's all there you can add the selected media and when you click it it will show up like that 
and also you can have the behavior it will be going up like uh, maybe you want to drifting fit to put it there and it will be showing up a little bit different in the video but it's cool if you want to make a project and try to do different thing with your video and make it more interesting for the audience see that's jumping and you can check that uh, behavior here it's shifting I'm sorry you can also scale up things this is all the animation that you want to make sure you just try it and make comfortable with anything you want and this is actually the cursor effect if you do the presentation using this media you can use that and this is a voice narration when I'm building making a video basically I'm gonna put the script there in the pass or type script and then start the recording so the microphone basically is going to record my video like this and after the I'm done with the narration I'm just gonna click stop and I will have to save it in a folder and there you go the narration and if uh, I play it it will show up in the videos including the narration and you can even update the narration this is for the audio you can make it fade in or fade out you can even increase the clip speed this is the visual effect you can make, make it green and if you want to make it green or things you want to make effect please don't forget to split the track it will be useful to make uh, to split the track uh, to split the video in the track so you can manage to make adjustment on one 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 side of the your videos in the track and will not affect the other thing interactivity basically just adding a quiz in your video if you want to engage more with your audience you will need it and it's kind of fun but of course you don't have to do that it depends on what is your uh, purpose of your video and this is the captions to make sure of the description of one part of the video so since con screen is best strategy game so I'll just put it there so this is this Camtasia studio is is great I know that there are many other uh, video maker but uh, from my experience this is one of the best if you want to be serious in doing a youtube channel but of course uh, I am not the marketing of the Camtasia studio but I just find it very useful using this uh, Camtasia studio and some part of the view it might not uh, showing up 
because of the nature of the video and when you share the video to YouTube you may have this uh, notification but you can just ignore it if you already enable uh, uploading longer video in YouTube actually it can be enabled if you make a verification on your YouTube account by using email or using uh, phone call or message this is you can input title and description text you can input it also the category so it's pretty much useful as I said earlier there are two step which is the rendering video it's making of the videos and also the second step is basically uploading to YouTube for a longer video it will take times for a simple video it may be just a few minutes I have uploaded the most is 30 minutes long and it's quite uh, if you want to perform the video with high definition so it will be much longer so I think that's it from me people so see you on another review and goodbye